What up, it's Melvin7 here, and today EA have fucked up. They've released the top 20 to 11 players on their website briefly, and everyone's got the screenshots, so I'm gonna show you them in these videos. In this video, sorry. Now, obviously, I'll rate them from 88 to 89, but the order doesn't really matter, and uh, I don't actually know what it was because I wasn't able to access the site in time. But I've got the images, so here we go. Enough rambling. 88 Raid Griezmann is the first one. Looks really, really good. That's a huge upgrade from his original 83, but he did very, very well for Athletic Madrid uh, last season. Sorry if you can hear me clicking, by the way. I'm clicking through the images as I uh, talk. Then we've got 88 Raid Higuain, obviously the fourth biggest uh, transfer fee of all time, I think, in real life. It looks like a decent card, maybe lacking a couple of stats. You would think shooting maybe a bit higher, but, you know, it doesn't look too bad overall. Then we've got Paul Pogba. Look at how ridiculous this card looks. Five-star skill moves, get in. Five-star skill. Paul Pogba, he's got some amazing stats across the board. Six foot three. This guy is going to be so expensive, and I'm so happy that he signed for Manchester United. Anyway, next we've got the most controversial rating of the lot. Pepe, 88. I don't think he deserves this at all, and I'm pretty sure a lot of other people will agree with me. But anyway... That's going to be a ridiculously OP card. And when you see Ramos's rating later on, like the, the Real Madrid's defense is stupidly good. Well, the entire team, to be fair. Then we've got another Real Madrid player in Luka Modric. Deserves his 89 rating up from an 87. Looks like a very solid card. 89 dribbling, 86 passing. And four-star skills and four-star weak foot. Then we move over to Thiago Silva. Getting an upgrade. Does he really deserve that? I, I don't watch League One too much, so I don't know. Uh, maybe he does. But uh, it looks like a very, very OP card. Pretty similar to his 88 rated, to be honest. Then a controversial one again. A lot of Chelsea fans will say no, it isn't. But a lot of other fans will be like, why is Courtois 89 when other goalkeepers like Buffon and Czech are 88? But you know what? It's a Premier League goalkeeper and he looks very, very solid there. Great stats and I'm very happy goalkeepers have been upgraded a lot. Uh, overall, then we've got Sergio Aguero, one of the best strikers in the world. Definitely deserves this 89 card, if not a 90, to be honest. But ridiculous as always. This the Aguero cards are, uh, on FIFA are just stupidly good anyway. The stats incredible 89 pace, 89 dribbling, four star skills, four star weak foot. Then we've got Sergio Ramos, probably going to be the best defender on the game. Ridiculous stats. I know Boateng's obviously 90. Uh, EA put that in their video, their trailer video, but he does look just such a well-rounded card and uh, definitely deserves an upgrade, I think, considering other defenders have as well. Then we move on to Ozil, 89 rated, one of the best playmakers in the world, definitely deserves this rating. Four-star skill moves, 86 dribbling, 87 passing. His stats aren't incredible, but the rating is definitely deserved in 89. So let me know what you think about these leaked ratings. Obviously, the top 10 will not be today it'll be tomorrow when you're watching this video so hopefully you have enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already like the video and yeah peace